What is going on ladies? In today's video, we're going to be doing a two-in-one booty and abs workout. And we have the lovely Essie joining us today. How did you find the workout? Intense. I am drenched in sweat and it just goes to show what you can do at home. Now, if you're going to get involved, I want you to smash the thumbs up button. I want you to leave a comment down below and let myself and Essie know how you found this workout. And listen, if you want something more intense or you want something more structured, I want you to go and download the ML Fitness app. There's a new program that just went live of myself and Essie, and I want you ladies to get involved with it. Click the link in the description. But enough of the talking, let's get into this intense two-in-one workout. Do you want to give them any encouraging words before they do the workout? Ladies, let's work out all winter so we can play all summer. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> all right, let's do this, ladies. Let's go. <laughs> You say you love me, I say you crazy We're nothing more than friends You're not my lover, more like a brother I know you since we were like 10 Yeah, don't mess it up Ladies, we are starting with a squat, going straight into a calf raise Remember, go at the same pace as us Because this is only a warm-up When reaching into your elbow and touching the tip of your toe, make sure you crunch and squeeze your abs as tight as possible. You got this. Remember ladies, we are only warming up, so make sure you are going at the same pace as myself and Essie. Keep moving. Spell friends, F-R-I-E-N-D-S, get that shit inside your head. No, no, yeah, uh, uh, F-R-I-E-N-D-S, <laughs> we're just friends. So don't go look at me no. with that look in your eyes. When performing side swings, make sure you are twisting as much as you can and you are squeezing your abs as tight as possible. Again, going at the same pace as us. Keep going.
is our last warm up exercise ladies, pulse, squat, stay nice and low, have a small bounce and get through that burn. Now you're going to have a 30 second rest, you can get some water, you can shake it off, you can just mentally prepare yourself because we are moving into the ab exercise. We're going to start off standing up and then we're going to go down onto the mat. Come on ladies, we can do this. That's it ladies, twist and squeeze, twist and squeeze. Bring your knee as high as possible and as always, squeeze your abs as tight as possible. Keep moving. all the way down your leg and lead with your elbow, squeezing your abs and you will feel it in your obliques. That's it ladies, keep that pace, keep that pace.
Now when performing this exercise, if the dumbbell is too heavy, as you can see Essie puts the dumbbell down and she's using her own body weight. So clap right under and squeeze those abs. So bringing yourself up halfway and reaching through your legs. If you have to pause for a few seconds like Essie right now, that is completely fine, but get yourself back into it. The reverse crunches make sure your knee goes as close as possible to your forehead squeezing those abs and it's controlled get through that burn Ladies, as you crunch yourself up with the dumbbell above your head, you're going to give yourself a 3 second negative going down nice and controlled and straight back up. Get through that burn. When doing Russian twists, make sure your head is following the dumbbell. Lean back a bit, keeping tension on your abs. And again, there is no rush. Go at the same pace as myself and Essie. You got this.
When performing leg raises, I want you to push your hips off the floor, reaching up to the ceiling and squeezing your abs. If you have lower back pain, you can put your hands just underneath your lower back for a bit of support. Amazing work everyone. Listen, you've got 20 seconds to relax, get some water. We are moving into legs and glutes. Now we're going to start off standing up and then we're going to make our way on the mat. You got this. When performing a reverse lunge with a kickback, I want it to be nice and slow as you might lose your balance. Remember, my muscle connection when doing the kickback, squeezing your glutes. When performing a single leg RDL, making sure you're hinging from the hips and you're not going outside of your range of motion. So stop just below your knee, squeeze your glutes at the top and control back down. Good work ladies, keep moving, you got this, nice and slow, focus on those glutes. This exercise is from Essie herself. You stay low with the opposite leg, you do small taps, you're going to feel tension in the front of your legs or quads. Make sure your core is nice and tight.
I know the burn is real, I know, but keep moving, small tap, stay low, core tight, and you got this. Placing the dumbbell on your pelvis, we're doing glute bridges nice and controlled with a two second pause at the top, squeezing your glutes, pushing from your heels. If you want it to be a bit more intense, raise the dumbbells above your head, keep your core tight and squeeze those glutes. When performing glute pulses, I want you to squeeze your glutes as tight as possible, get through that burn and let's build that booty. Now we are doing donkey kickbacks, I want you to kick your heels up towards the ceiling, keep your core engaged and every time you reach to the top, you squeeze those glutes. ladies you got this get through that burn if you stop count yourself down from free and get back into it
when performing fire hydrants, I want you to have a small pulse, keeping constant tension on your glutes. Now listen, if you have to stop for a second, you can, but I want you to get back into the hard work. Come on, ladies. I know you're feeling the burn just like Essie, but you know what? She got straight back into it and you're gonna do the same. Amazing work ladies, give yourself a round of applause. But we are not finished, we need to do a warm down. So in the next 20 seconds, you're going back onto the mat and we are going to stretch and warm down. Good work.
done. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you are sweating like myself and Essie. Essie, do you want to give them any encouraging words moving forwards from here? Be proud of yourself for dedicating 30 minutes of your day to your health and your well-being. That's it. That is exactly it. Listen, ladies, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment, and don't forget to go and download the ML Fitness app so we can work together. All right. Peace.